Hey guys, it's Summer. I'm just coming to um, kind of let you guys know what's going on with me right now. Um, I currently have my hair in braids for braid out. Um, I'm trying a new technique that I learned um, from Twitter. I um, am I follow a girl. Her name is Black is Beautiful. I know some of you follow her. She's on. Um, she has a blog and she's got her YouTube channel. It's B L A K. I Z B A U T Y F U L. So she's cool. She posted a video about having okay. So the thing is braids up until the end, and then two strand twists at the very end to make that curl up. Um, I know I've experienced the same thing that she was talking about in her video. Like um, you do a braid out, and then it looks cute all throughout the hair, and then at the end it looks all bushy because. You know, at the bra with the braids, it doesn't do the same thing it does with two strand twists. So, and I'm like, I've been natural for two years, and I've never tried it this way. So I figured I would do it because it looked cool and interesting. Um, and I was gonna do a video taking it down, but I come here, honey. <laughs> Everybody, this is Domino. Um, yeah, and he likes to distract me when I'm making videos. Hey, baby. Um. But yeah, he, um, somebody commented and said that they thought Domino was my son, like my child. Um, definitely don't have human children. This is all I do. Um, and he likes attention. So if I'm doing something else, he likes to be involved. Um, so maybe he'll get his fill and get down in a minute. Anyway, my hair, um, these are the braids. <laughs> I'm trying to get back to where I was before. Um. So I was going to do a video taking it down now, but I'm going to go to the gym tonight. So I don't need to be all extra cute if I'm just going to the gym. So um, I'll do that video tomorrow morning after I take it down and I'm going to work and stuff. At least I'll have like a purpose, you know. Um, so I was going to show you um, about a style that I do. Like I do an updo when I have my hair like this and I'm wearing it out. Because, um, you know, sometimes if you wash your hair at night or something like that and you wake up and it's still not dry, I know I have that issue because um, my hair is really thick and it's getting longer, so um, it doesn't dry as fast as it used to. So when I do braid outs and stuff, sometimes it's still damp and stuff on the inside. Um, and I'll do like an updo or something in order to, you know, still keep it twisted or braided and, um, you know, uh, to let it dry just to still say stay like that because you know I probably know I wouldn't wear my hair out like this anywhere <laughs> so I'm gonna put it up um, I was gonna show you how I do that but Domino wants to hang out right now so I'll show you that to you later um, and my earrings you can see them they are um, a little comb I got them at the event um, the Fro Fashion Week that was last weekend We've been before I'm not sure it's been a long journey uh, the last couple weeks have been like a blur to me um, I've been in Atlanta I've been in Augusta um, one of my friends just had surgery on her shoulder so I went down to help her out to be the nurse and stuff like that while she was getting better and she's okay now everything's fine um, she's pretty self-sufficient right now but at first she just couldn't do a whole lot of moving around and stuff so um, I was nursed for a little bit but, um, yeah, the earrings I got, I'll put the, um, the website where you can get them in the description box. I think they were only like $13 or something like that. They weren't too expensive. And they do feel like good quality. They're not like heavy, but you can tell, you know, you can tell when stuff is made well, like they're not going to break. Um, like I'm really excited about them. They're my new favorites. They're little combs. Aw. <laughs> Alright, I'll put her information down there. Um, also I did want to let you know I did uh, I broke my uh, New Year's resolution in February so I guess that didn't really work out too well um, but I feel like it's not as bad because I um, the product that I purchased was something that I've had before and that I know works for me it's not like I tried something totally new just to see if it was gonna work you know I've done that I've wasted money on stuff that I don't feel was worth my money you know just to try something new that other people said they liked um, but what I bought was um, Clails by Nature. This is um, the hair butter. It's a hair and body butter, so you can use it on your skin. It's, this one's Citrus Bliss. 
Um, I got Marvelous Mango and I got a watermelon one too. Um, that smells good. It doesn't smell like actual watermelon. I really don't like watermelon at all, but this one smells really good, so. Um, yeah, Citrus Bliss. I like this one. It's really clean, like, it's not overbearing, like, you know, because a lot of people don't like fruity stuff, but this one just smells clean and nice, so. Um, that's the Coils by Nature that I purchased, and that's really the only product that I bought, so I feel like that's a good job. I bought several pairs of earrings, though. Um, you gotta compensate. What I did last night, I um, detangled with my Protective Mist Botifier from Tilia Wajid. And I used my big uh, wide tooth comb. Oh, he's sitting on my lap now. Maybe I can do this. So I'll just try. Um, so yeah, Tilia Wajid's um, Protective Mist Botifier. I used the Quells by Nature. Uh, after I detangled and I braided it and twisted it and I used a little bit of the lock it up gel of course I always use that one let's see if I can do this real quick with him sitting here actually I'm not gonna attempt that because he's gonna freak out um so there's that and um real quick let's show you my fingernails this I know I love it I'm not really a girly girl and I don't really talk about like nail polish or makeup or whatever but this is um China Glaze uh, Crackle. I bought all the colors that they had. I got it at Ulta. It's really awesome. Like if you haven't seen it, watch videos on it. The Crackle or OPI makes one called Shattered. Like you put on your base color, whatever you want your base color to be. Mine is just a pink one. Um, and the black is the Crackle. Like it looks like paint chipped off of it or something like that. Let me get out of the way. Can you see that? I don't know. But I think it looks really awesome. I'm really excited about it. Like you put it on and as it dries it just cracks up like it's old paint or something. And I did this on Saturday and today is Wednesday. And it hasn't really cracked or anything like other than the regular cracking. Um, like it's hanging on there really good. Like I'm excited to try all the different colors so I'm waiting for it to crack up so I can change the colors. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So that's everything that I'm going to do right now. Um, I'll do an updo later and I'll probably show you what this braid out looks like tomorrow. Um, Alright, I love you guys. I'll see you later. Peace.